Well, you know, Jason Michael has introduced us to everything from new coffee shops to fitness studios in his new in town series. Which I love, but tonight we have a very special new restaurant to spotlight, the Executive Grill. Absolutely. All right, guys, let's take a look at this new restaurant. It is surely just something oh so special. Oops. It's actually run by high school students right here in the CLE. I got the chance to visit the students at part of CMSD's culinary arts program to see the amazing things they're cooking up. When you come in, our menu is pretty cozy, lunch friendly, but also a little sophisticated at the same time. We try to make everything house-made as possible. Jonathan Garner is the executive chef here at the Executive Grill, but his role extends far beyond the kitchen. It also goes into the classroom. It's a uh, career program with culinary arts here on East Tech campus. We have six career programs, we're one of them, and so we do a full-scale training of restaurant service and hospitality industry. The positive impact and impression are endless. Students here at Cleveland Culinary Arts learned everything from food safety and service to knife skills and pairings. We just make sure we want them to be a well-balanced chef in person and as a whole. The Executive Grill, a beautiful and brand new space housed in the former pool at CMSD's East Tech High School. Here, they have space for classrooms, a state-of-the-art kitchen, and a dining room that is open for lunch. This program has been in effect for 26 years. And once uh, they decided to close Jane Adams as educational facility, East Tech opened their arms to us and we began on this project. This isn't just a restaurant. This isn't just a dining experience. This is a culinary incubator. Yes. It's also a place to display the hard work of other CMSD students and programs. We have a beautiful mural made by Cleveland School of the Arts. Everything pretty much in the dining room is a different collab of different people. So our sal salad bar comes from our urban agriculture program. Here. Plus, the flower arrangements are made by horticulture students and displayed in vases 3D printed by the district's robotics team. That is truly, truly amazing. So these kids, they certainly have something to kind of champion and pat themselves on the back. Yes, they do. They, they come in champions every day. They're very proud. It's a true example of the scarab pride I got to see firsthand as I sampled the menu. All right, I have my man Dantes Hayes here. He's a junior at East Tech High School working in the Executive Grill. Dantes, thank you so much for being here with me. Thank you for having me. Tell me about the things that we have here on the table. Uh, we've got a wing platter with some mashed potatoes and some corn. Okay. okay. We have a buffalo onion, it's like a different type of style of pieces that we make. We have our onion rings with the onion ring sauce that I just made, recently made. Time to dig in. Then it was a time to try one of Dante's favorites, a spicy chicken wrap. Why is this your favorite? It's because of my culture. I'm Mexican. My uh, grandfather was Mexican. I love to make tacos. I love to make burritos. I love to make a lot of Mexican food, and I love Mexican food, period. The moment of truth. Oh. This is amazing. Dantes, thank you so much. I think you guys are doing some amazing work here. Thank you. Guys, if you have not made it to the Executive Grill to try these guys out, Wednesday, Thursdays, 11 a.m. to 1 p.m., I promise you, you will love it. And I trust me, I made out like a bandit with all that food. As mentioned, the Executive Grill is open for lunch on Wednesdays and Thursdays from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. It is open to the public, but you do need to call and also make a reservation. They're also having an end of the year barbecue next Thursday. So mark your calendars May 18th before they pick up their summer season. Tuesdays at Perk Plaza and in Public Square for Walnut Wednesdays. Oh, there you go. For all of these tasty treats, we have all the information up on our website, WKYC.com. This was a particularly very touching story for me because seeing these students, these yeah. young minds, make such incredible food, wow. front house, the back of house, it was no consolations to show a bright spotlight on them. Oh, That's great, huh? What a brilliant idea. Yes, and I yeah, love how absolutely. it touched all aspects uh, in the high school because yes. you have the music department because mm -hmm. a jazz band was playing, the art department right. with yes. the murals, the science and engineering with the robotics team. Yep, the, the wood. 3D painting, yeah. Yep. Wow, well, brilliant. You described it perfectly, a culinary incubator. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right? Huh? That's yeah. pretty cool. Scare pride through and through. There you oh, go. All right.